on Vaisas Matias it was. Hi guys, welcome to another video, exploring video with myself and Johan Rodrik. Say hello. Hello. Hello, hello. And he's brought us to a place called Durisalu. 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 And uh, yeah, check this out. This place is huge. I'm very excited about this. You can see the ruins of whatever the hell that was. I have no idea, <laughs> but, uh, but it was masonry. Oh, okay, interesting. <laughs> uh, that, that's all I can say. I, I, I have no, I'm not, a, not that much an expert. So this was a former military area, wasn't it? Yeah, it's a vast uh, uh, missile base. Oh, okay, yeah, because... Uh, it is on Google Map as well. Oh. Uh, there's Turisalu Raketti Baas written on uh, Google Map. Huh. I was say, yeah, because all of these posts are all around this area it's surrounding it. Post. Yeah. The blurry camera. Just that way. But yeah, you can already see the scale of this. It's huge. It's, <laughs> as Donald Trump would say, it's huge. Oh, okay. with, with a silent H. Oh. Holy cow! Yeah, that's a, that's a nice place. Right, okay, to give you some context, uh, Johan did a video of this, because he's been here before. Yeah, I've been here multiple times. Right, and on the thumbnail, i got to say it looked kind of small, but in real life, this is huge! Why is this mad? Yeah. It's some sort of a hanger or... Uh, something. I have no idea what it is. Uh, what, what's the purpose of that? But it's beautiful. <laughs> well, I don't know if I call it beautiful, but it's definitely something. Yeah. That's a material for pretty concrete content. <laughs> Again, with the concrete jokes, man. <laughs> How do you still find that funny? <laughs> Mad man. <laughs> That's something that never gets old. Ah! This would be... Dude, come on. <laughs> this would be sick for a music video, something like that. There's other room behind this. Yeah, I'm intrigued by that. I yeah, the, you saw the entrances on the side. Uh, we have to walk around the side and uh, check it. Uh, then uh, we can get the entry. Oh, nice one. But uh, we can also find a treasure in the other room. Maybe. Yeah, there is a uh, treasure hidden there. Uh, there is a game uh, that players are looking treasures and uh, we can leave our names there that we found it. Why not? This is so cool, man. Somebody has thrown a smoke bomb here or something. of this is incredible. I think the, you know, I don't know if I've said this before, but it still kind of astonishes me how many of these places exist in Estonia. Yeah. And they're just, they're not like there's, I mean, okay, to give this some context, there is no kind of um, preservation here, you know, like to protect these areas. There's no official, you know, like, it's nothing here. Yeah, it's, it's just, it's just here. It's in the uh, middle of bushes. Right, and I know that's kind of the point of abandoned spots, but it still kind of amazes me, you know? Like, this is, these are places of historical significance, and there's just tons of them, and they just happen to be here, and that's it. <laughs> Some of them have been demolished. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, so there's th nothing to see. Right, but there's like so many of them that are intact. Uh, I mean, yeah. the fact the fact that we've already together have done and explored probably what well, at least ten to twelve already together, uh, maybe more. Uh, yeah, we have that's uh, how many? Yeah, we have done a few. Wait. <laughs> yeah. We have done more than ten, I guess. 
yeah, and that that to me blows me away as well. Like just how many we've done already. Yeah. Can we get in? Get all of that. Oh wow, that's warm. That was worth it. <laughs> Whole lot of nothing. Oh yeah, the, the next room is a little bit more interesting. Uh, there, uh, <laughs> There's a slightly bigger floor. Yeah, yeah, it's a bigger <laughs> floor, but uh, that's uh, uh, the same room that we found uh, peeking through the uh, hole we found in the round room. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what is the name of the room, uh, how it's, uh, what's the term for this kind of uh, thing? Ceiling? Uh, no, no, I mean, uh, what's the uh, term of this round room we found? It has some specific term for it. Mm. Some sort of a military term, I don't know what it is. Yeah, I'm drawing a blank right now. Somebody knows, then uh, leave yeah. a comment. Yeah, leave a comment. Let us know what, what's the official term for that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> now, this is uh, where we can find the treasure. All right, hold that on. Me. Fix my light. Oh, God damn it. Yeah, Fix. Right. No, like this. Full, full action, this pump action. Ah, oh, oh my God, I'm such an idiot. We've got the same torch, that's why. Now, this is the room that we, uh, I mentioned earlier when we were filming a hole in the wall. Ah, oh, okay. Hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah, and there here it is. This is the treasure. Oh, cool. Uh, the game uh, is called uh, Geo Chasing. Okay. And uh, we just happened to find it. So what, you just put something in there to signify that you've... No, 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 we will do that. Uh, okay. I think I'll put my card in there. That said, uh, Eola Brugi, which means this is not trash. Yeah, 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 exactly. But this is the game that treasure hunters play. That's old Soviet, right there. Yeah, Russian... Uh... Never, never seen that before in, in these videos. Oh, that's cool. That's some sort of a technical room, I guess. Yeah. I wonder if I can get up here. What? Just wondering if I can get up here, if there's anything interesting here. You want to get up there? Maybe. Just, uh, you can get up there. No, I know, I know, I know. Um, give me a second. Oh, oh wow. Ah, oh my god. Sorry guys, I'm just going to use this time to climb up there. Oh, thanks. No, step here. Step on your knee? Yeah, exactly, that's the strongest point. Thank you. Ah. Ow, that hurt. Ah. Was it worth it? I don't know. No. <laughs> but hey. That's a typical part of the exploration. You, uh, you climb up somewhere and uh, you found uh, a wall. Maybe. But check what's there. That's... This, this is kind of cool. Uh, le I, if I would have to guess, uh, it may be a ventilation uh, uh, pump chamber or something. Yeah. Maybe some sort of a technical room because it's too small for human activity. Like as we just found. And you can get down a little bit easier. Mm-hmm. Alright. Yeah. Pause so, this uh, for a second. Johan just went to the car and I'm currently on my own right now. Mm -hmm. And uh yeah, this was the uh, little sort of lunch box where uh, people leave little uh, notes and uh, by the looks of things some uh, I don't know trinkets and uh, what's that disinfectant swab but anyway they have this little booklet and uh, hold on Let's see if I can how do I do this yeah so you can see I've left a little message in here and uh, people who've discovered it 
in the past can I leave little messages and notes that they've discovered it and uh, yeah I just think that's a really cool thing like a cool idea for explorers to do I've never seen that before but um, it's a good way of I suppose letting people know that you've explored it and maybe that you're an explorer and you do videos like this and uh, yeah cool stuff um, yeah, this is this is an interesting place. I think this is the first place I've discovered that actually has, you know, classic uh, Cyrillic Russian letters still intact. Always look new. And uh, yeah, very cool. I dig it. Hoi, Jesus. That's a tight squeeze. Raw, this is sketchy. It's oh, literally shitty. just trash. Trash, trash, trash. Talk about trash place. Do I even want to go here? Oh, there's like literally a toilet there. Oh. That's not the worst thing. No. But that's literally. Uh, Full, stuffed full of junk as far as I can see. Wow. Literally. So What's interesting about that is like someone has gone to the effort of like delving in there and, yeah. trash, and trashing it. Like, yeah, that's why they close off the driveways uh, to places like those. Yeah. This was accessible with SUV only, this place. Mm. But uh, SUV guys usually don't transport trash into the nature. <laughs> It's van guys who do that. Yeah. So nothing to see here. Uh, worth, worth checking out at least. I have no idea what it is, but it is something. <laughs> yeah. What's up, Jack? Wonder what this was. Hey, Johan, what do you reckon this was? I'm thinking. Let me know in the comments what you think this might be. Because I ain't got no idea. Can we get in there? Nope. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Doesn't look like much. But it's home. <laughs> It just looks like marshlands around here at the moment. Ooh, interesting. Watch the ground. Mm. Because you don't want to fall in. Pay attention to the ground. That's something, some sort of, I don't know what. It's but totally flooded. Yeah. And I, ha I can't tell how much water is down there, but I don't want to be down there. Really? Yeah, Why I'd ever not? I prefer a little bit drier, please. <laughs> well, it was worth it for this view. Check that out. Oh, yeah, man. Dig it! I just love the colours of this time of year. Uh, it almost looks like um, like autumn colours, really. Like not... Almost the end of January. Yeah, I know, but like the the colours are like not really winter colours, if you oh, know what I mean. Oh, okay. Maybe I'm just talking nonsense. I don't know. <laughs> like express exploring, like <laughs> like literally, we've done maybe three or four locations in the space of like five minutes. Oh, yeah. It's a drive-in edition. <laughs> Express uh, edition. Drive -in. Express edition. Exploring drive-in. This is cool. Little little small bunker. That's like a bunker then. Yeah. I gotta say like oh disgusting. Um it is a good place to crash if uh you're homeless or uh, you want to get away from the um, 
the bad weather, because as soon as you walk in, you can't feel the weather at all. Yeah, but it is uh, too far in the countryside for homeless activity. Yeah, but you've no, you've clearly got people that have have lived here or. or no, at least. somebody disposing junk. Oh yeah, maybe you're right actually. Uh, that's uh, more like a disposal. Well, that was that. I may not notice uh, depression in the ground or something that may lead into uh, some place that uh, that may hide something worth seeing. If nothing else, it's just worth it for the view. I mean, it's not even, we're not even that far off ground and you can see quite far. It's so calming. I think that's one of the things I like about the Estonian uh, countryside. I mean, okay, we're not really, really deep in the countryside. There's cars still and stuff, but still, very cool. <laughs> it's a nice moment. Yeah. Oh yeah. All right, right off the bat, this has got some dirty industrial smell. Ugh. Disgusting. Somebody has cleaned up here. Oh really? Have they? Yeah, that's. Uh, <laughs> it, it, it's been bulldozed. Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Probably was much worse junkyard. I was gonna say like. Didn't really do much of a great job, did they? But yeah, no, they've cleared it out. Definitely. Well, if you have the comparison what it was earlier, then it would be probably 90% cleaner. True. Oh. But that's a, like a stage here, if you check that way. Oh. It just looks like a standard warehouse, I think. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what the purpose of this is. It's got to be. What is that? Just heard some really weird sound. Yo, that was creepy. Some sort of a sound. I, re I reckon that was birds. Yeah, I think, absolutely. It could be because here is so much echo. And uh, some sort of an animal sound can uh, transform into something. Uh, yeah. Because of the echo connection and the uh, sound effects. I have experienced uh, much creepier uh, places than this. What's the creepiest thing you've ever experienced? Uh, like in lava tunnels, if you stand there quiet, uh, the dripping water will sound like talking. Wow, that's creepy. But uh, it's, uh, uh, the water drops are coming and they are echoing, and they're echoing multiple times, mm -hmm. and uh, their uh, drip sounds will uh, eventually end up uh, as uh, looking, si hearing, sounding similar to uh, talking. Yeah, like so, when your brain yeah, so, begins to yeah, trick you. Yeah, if you stand silently there, uh, you feel like there is somebody talking, but there is nobody talking. There is nobody else. <laughs> yeah. That would be really creepy if you have to be there alone for a long, prolonged periods of time. That's why I prefer exploring with you rather than going on my own. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't been there alone, but uh, I was with a historian oh, okay. uh, there. Cool. It's pretty big scale, isn't it? Oh, wow. That's, that's cool. Oh, Jesus. Oh, hey, that's cool. It's a cool vision. Hey, screw you. What is that? Anyway, Jesus, something out of like the early 2000s. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Don't 
really much to say here, really, is there? <laughs> totally trashed. Sorry, a flower pot. <laughs> this looks like a crappy flower pot. <laughs> Relatively intact. I mean, in terms of the base of the structure. Yeah. It's quite surprising, really. Yes. 